In this lesson, I quickly wanted to review something, and that's why is the host ID 64 bits? In all of the three types of address, be it the global address, 64 bits, link local, 64 bits, and unique local, 64 bits. Why do I possibly need that many bits to just define what is really the house number? After all, 64 bits is double the number of bits available for the entire IPv4 range. I have 16 bits just for the subnetting alone. The reason it's 64 bits is, well, there's 128 bits available. 64 bits alone is plenty for the network address space. So 64 bits reserved for the interface ID enables a number of different mappings to be used in that interface ID. For example, because it's 64 bits, I could base the interface ID off of the MAC address. Remember, the MAC address is 48 bits. So you could actually map the entire MAC address, which you know is globally unique, that's set by the hardware manufacturer. I could map that as part of the interface ID. It could be randomly generated. This could change periodically. It could avoid anyone tracking me. It could be assigned via DHCP, it could be a manual configuration. But by having it that large, the real key thing it gives me is that MAC address possibility to make that part of it. And it means I can change it up to avoid any kind of tracking. 